Yeah, what's up guys, Citron Zero Balls here, and today we're going to be playing Undertale again, but this time we're going to be doing the genocide route. Let's get straight into it. I might skip quite a lot of the dialogue, if you want to see that, um, look at my original playthrough of the game. I have a playlist as well, sorted out for it. Cause this, I'll, I'll not skip the bits that um, are different, but this will just be the exact same, because... You know, it, it's like it's not gonna change because I just did neutral last time. Please adjust yourself to the sight of them. Make progress things. Yeah, it's just the same. I'll just get through this, because hopefully if I can do it quicker, it'll be a less longer playthrough of the game. I don't know when we start encountering monsters, because apparently it's going to be like a long farming thing. So. See, this is where I encountered the first one. If we want to do this, we have to get it in the middle to kill the frog. It. I don't know if we encounter some more around here. This method is good for doing it. And we know about this. Um, why did it just stop? Hold on, guys, I'm just, um... Right, guys, I'm back. I was just searching the way you first think out of monsters, so no. We all need to kill 20 creatures as well as Toriel. I don't think there's any enemies in there. Why was I walking into the wall? Oh. Whoops. This is my child, do not worry, I did not leave you. I just want to know when you encounter monsters, because I need to know. Save point. So there's some monsters around here then. Let's look in the grass piles. And you know, sometimes it takes ages for them to come out. You just gotta keep going back and forth. There you go. Bow, bow. There's another one there. If you want, you can skip the video to um the part where I actually actually do end up doing stuff. I don't think there'll be any monsters around here. But never mind. The frog it didn't actually get one shot, unlike the first one. The first one I got 10 XP from. Let me see up here. No. Okay. Right, let's go ahead and that. Oh, there's another one. It's another frog it. Oh. oh. I think we can carry on now. Yeah, let's carry on. I'm sure if there's wait, let's just let me just check one more bit. Because you literally have to check all of these rooms. See, for extra ones like that. 
You have to make sure there is none that exist. I don't think there's any down here. I don't believe. Never mind, I'm wrong. I need to level up again. Though, if there's one there, there should be more somewhere. Apparently, this tactic works doing it. I like the sounds that they make when you hit them, just, hey! It sounds so weird. Oh my god. Alright, is there one more I can get from down here? Is that all of them? One more? Unless they've both been on that side. Okay, that'll be the last one I think from this room. I'm level 3 already. Bam. 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 I do not care about you, Toriel. I will just skip your dialogue. Because I do not need to know about you. Shut up. I do not care. I don't think there's any monsters in this room. Never mind. I always say that and then one appears. And it's because I didn't think there would be because Toriel was... This is a room where obviously Toriel phones you. So I don't think... So anymore. One more. Spare change. Found another one. I've got a decent amount for now. I think I remember the puzzle from this. Uh, yeah, I've got it. That was actually just a muscle memory, that was. Oh, we encountered another one. This time I weren't even trying to encounter them, counter them even. If I can speak. I would literally just doing the that puzzle right let's I don't think that one's on properly there we go whoa there partner you can you can push me around I like I really like the rocks character especially when, when I first saw it speaking of the rock that new song is so hyped up that um there's a pet somewhere I think it's an alright song, but it's not like it's something new that we've never heard of before, it's magical. But Yeah, it like blew up, didn't it? Is there no monsters in here other than that's the book? I don't think you can from what I've heard, I don't think you can kill much the book, so you might as well just do this, cause Apparently you get minus an XP. Alright. Uh, I'll just float and I don't know. <laughs> I really love this music. Let me try. You can cry it upside down. Call it Dapper Block. Golden Comedy. How do you even cry upwards? That's what I want to know. Oh. He cried down a little bit. I saw that. Is there any monsters in this room? I know you can just speak to them. They don't actually like do anything. No, you can't actually like fight them or anything. Spare change. Got the spare change. I know in one, in like two of these holes, you can encounter a monster. I think. Oh wait, no, it's just one. I think. I don't know. There's usually a carrot in one of these. I guess there just isn't. I guess it just does not exist. Is this the right one? <sighs> Hello, Napster book. What are you doing? You fell down a hole. 
So it's this one then. Pull the lever. Hopefully there's a monster in this room. I need some more monsters. Because I've not seen any recently. I don't think there is any monsters in this room. So I'm not encountering any. I don't think there's any spawns. Which one do you have to click on this? Press the blue, which is this one. Behind here. It's a switch, press it. I know which one you have to press for the other puzzle. Hey, we finally found one. We found two. Oh, crap. That's one of them down. He just dances. It'd be so easy to do on a pacifist run, or like true pacifist, whatever. Because he, he just doesn't attack you, I think. Not even if you move. I got 8 XP for that. That's so cool. And I believe you have to press... Okay, wait, no, it's not, it's not this room. It's the room after that I was about. Which switch do you have to press on this? Press the red one. It's a switch. Press it. Hear a clicking sound. I know which one it is on this. It's this one. Yeah. I'm going to say if they didn't change it. Back change. There's usually some in the leaf piles. Could be wrong, but there's usually the non. What's in here? Oh, the toy knife. I might as well equip this just so I do more damage. Item, toy knife, equipped. I don't think I've killed enough monsters though, so I think I'll need to go back. Because you have to kill a certain amount. Yeah, that's that's not enough. I need to go back and kill him. Oh, I heard you need to kill 20. I don't know how many I've killed. But I need to farm more. Apparently this works. So I'm just like, do this in hopes that maybe a little bit of chance. It works. And it did. Oh, whoa. Don't you throw your corn and potato at me. I ain't done nothing to you. Farm locally. Why are you throwing corn at me? What have I actually done to deserve this? Why is it coming from the other way? Oh wait, is that just me? I think that's just me. I don't know, actually. Let's do this method again. Because this apparently, some, why does this even work? Why does this actually work? Uh, maybe. It worked last time. I don't I don't think it works in the same spot again. Uh, oh. Two people again. Dun, 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 dun. Let's check how many I need to do after this. I'm aiming to just kill Toriel and get past a little bit of that. If I can, that would be nice. How do I know when I've killed 20? Am I missing something? Because it doesn't seem to 
done it. I think we could just, I think we just got a farm, I guess. This is probably the most boringest part of the genocide run. Having to farm enemies is like, because you just gotta do this and just find them for like ages, just to do a certain route. It's kind of annoying. I wish there was like a way to just like get a load of kills. Whoa! I can't avoid all of them. Mold, small. Do do do. do. Swing your hips, I think. I'm level four. Do I need to carry on doing this? Or was that the last of the enemies I had to kill? I think that might have been it. Can I just find one more? I literally just want to find one more. Because I don't know, I think that's, like every time you do the strat, it comes up with two enemies. So, every time I do this, two enemies, like, now let me, let me reset it. Let me walk out and back in. But nobody came. Okay, yeah, so we've done, the genocide bits. I'll do up to Toriel, and then the save after that. Um, well, what do you call it? Stop. It's got that music. Determination. Literally, what it says. The I do not smell that. I have to go to sleep. I have to get up in the middle of the night and then bug Toriel on how to leave the ruins. The music in here is like so peaceful. When can I go home? No, I don't want I don't want a snail flag. No. I'm trying to skip it. No, Toriel, you're not running. Not like if you walk at the same pace as Toriel, when you go to the next screen, she's just not there. She's just like disappeared. But yeah, if you want, like I said, guys, if you want to watch the dialogue, then uh, watch my original playthroughs, cause uh, I don't, really, I don't skip any of the dialogue in there, cause. It's my f first time playing, well, recording. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe. It would mean a lot. But just a like or subscribe, it means a lot. Toriel. So apparently now that, that damage is just, you know, you really hate me. Okay, this is different dialogue. You really hate me that much. Now I see who I was protecting by keeping you here. Not you, but them. Ha, ha. Damn, 22,000 damage. Sad times, Toriel's just gone. And now we walk. We walk forever. <laughs> oh, Flowey's here again. <laughs> You're not really human, are you? This isn't from the other playthrough either. No. 
you're empty inside, just like me. In fact, you're Zach, right? We're still inseparable after all these years. Listen, I have a plan to become more powerful. Even more powerful than you and your stolen soul, even. Let's destroy everything in this wretched world. Everyone. Everything in these worthless memories. Let's turn them all to dust. The hell? Undertale. Dun dun dun. By Toby Fox. Dun dun dun. Well, what has happened? Right, there we go. Potential monsters. My name is Papyrus. I'm the skeleton. Made from lots of bolts and lots of coal. What? What the hell was that? Totally wasn't the sounds. Sands is walking slowly. What the hell? Right, see, so yeah, if you like said, come on, if you're still watching, if you want to watch the rest of the dialogue, just, uh, you know, you know what to do. I've already said it twice. <laughs> Conveniently shaped lamp. Actually, out of 16 months. I think I'll do a little bit longer of a playthrough. I do like a couple more minutes. You decide not to call. We've already found one. Already. 50 damage. Whoa! Whoa, chill. Why did we make that sound? Found another monster, Ice Cap. Does it work on her? No. It only works on this thing. I think you have to do it on the wall if you want it to properly work. Don't move an inch, okay. I get so much XP from this. We'll get to the next save and then we'll stop. Snowman piece, I will take it. Wait. <laughs> I just took like the whole of them. I don't think I was supposed to do that. Oh, so we find another monster. Lesser dog. Pant, pant. Well. Leveled up again.
Oh wait, that was a bit of different dialogue. Basically, the only thing different was it's just that Sans is getting mad because we weren't playing along with the puzzle thing. So he was getting a bit mad at us. That's that's the only really difference, though. Uh, from what I gathered, anyway. Sounds like that did nothing. Right, that's the latest say 13 left. Right then guys, this has been fun. Other than I just hate the grinding, but oh well. Other than that, I can tell tell this is gonna be a fun route and hopefully some stuff majorly changes later on in the game. Anyway guys, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.